The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to Matthew. Glory to you. When the Pharisees heard that Jesus had silenced the Sadducees, they gathered together, and one of them, a scholar of the law, tested Jesus by asking, Teacher, which commandment in the law is the greatest? He said to him, You shall love the Lord your God with all your heart, with all your soul, and with all your mind. This is the greatest and the first commandment. The second is like it. You shall love your neighbor as yourself. The whole law and the prophets depend on these two commandments. The Gospel of the Lord. We all know that the nature of law or laws is, um, it's, um, well, maybe I'll give you an example, Obamacare. And it's hard to interpret things like Obamacare because the law as it was passed by Congress was a law over 1,300 pages. And that's amazing, isn't it? How can you follow 1,300 pages? That make any sense? Of course it doesn't. That's the nature of law. It complicates. Um, in fact, God gave us a law and it was called the Ten Commandments. You have heard of those, haven't you? <laughs> the Ten Commandments. When Jesus um, was speaking to these lawyers in the gospel this morning, the lawyers over the years from the time of Moses to the time of Jesus, which is roughly about 1200 years, had turned the 10 commandments into 318 commandments. Did you know that? Aren't you glad you came to mass? So the nature of law is to complicate it. Jesus' whole, whole idea for us is to make everything very simple. And so if we are true disciples, if we're striving to be Jesus' disciples, he even takes the Ten Commandments and boils them down into two commandments. You can remember, and I can remember, two things, right? Two things, and he just gave them to us. I hope you remember. 